Madison goes right to work here at Kittatinny. Watch Pat Zerman on the first play from scrimmage on the sweep. Take it up the far sideline for 43 yards before Joe Rapazzi saves the touchdown for Kittatinny at the Cougars 36. Then off the fake pitch, Madison quarterback Sam North hits Christian Scarpello for the touchdown from 35 yards out, and the Dodgers have a 7-0 lead here in the first quarter. Madison gets the ball back, and on fourth down, they fake the punt, but Dylan Wonder and Tom Hunt aren't fooled for Kittatinny as Madison turns the ball over on downs near midfield. Then it's Vinny Franco Kittatinny on the pitch as he takes it upfield for 16 yards and a first down to the Madison 34, but Kittatinny would be forced to punt. Kittatinny's defense played tough in the first quarter. Watch Garrett Armstrong break in as Vinny Franco and Dylan Wonder come in to finish off Don Lapino for the loss of seven yards and Madison has to punt. Now here's a wild play. Watch Kittatinny's Dylan Wonder hit the hole, but big old Will Matola Madison pops the ball out and Pat Zerman catches it on the fly for the fumble, and Madison has a 7-0 lead after one quarter. Second quarter we go, and Madison cashes in the turnover here, while David Ludinger bull his way in from four yards out, and the Dodgers have a 13-0 lead over the Cougars. Like I said, Kittatinny's defense played hard. Watch Pat Logan rush in and get the sack as he drops A.J. Schmitz for nine-yard loss, and the Cougars force a Dodgers punt. Kittatinny gets the ball back late in the second quarter. Watch Garrett Armstrong take off, and he picks up 19 yards and a first down for the Cougars. And then on the final play of the half, watch Garrett Armstrong with plenty of time. He finds Joe Rapazzi, but he's dragged down at the Madison 5 as time expires, and it's 13-0 Madison at the half. Okay, third quarter we go, and Kittatinny's putting a drive together. Watch Garrett Armstrong use the stiff arm as he picks up a first down for the Cougars at the Madison 28. But the drive ends here for Kittatinny on the pick by Darnell Golson, who is run out of bounds at the Madison 23. Tough break there for the Cougars. And Madison scores here on the five-yard jet sweep from Noah Gettler as the Dodgers push their lead to 21-0 over Kittatinny. Fourth quarter we go, and the Dodgers are on the move again. Watch quarterback Sam North find a wide-open Dylan Gilchinski off the play action for the 21-yard score, and Madison has a commanding 27-0 lead. On the ensuing kickoff, watch Garrett Armstrong field it at the 23 and work his way all the way down to the one-yard line. Watch the great hustle here by Dornell St. Germain, who saves the touchdown for the Madison Dodgers at the one-yard line. Wow. But Kittatinny would score here as Dylan Wonder takes it in, but the Cougars would fall to 4-4 four four as they fall to Madison, 27-7 at Kittatinny Regional High School. I think we probably got the eight seed, so it looks like we are going to be able to play in a tournament after after next week. But obviously, we've got to set our sights on uh, Jefferson next week. We know they're coming in here. You know, we know what they bring to the table. Another tough game for us. And you know, we want to finish solid in our in our league play. Try to keep secure that 500 record in the league, and then uh, you know, we'll see what the tournament brings us. And Jefferson, who's been showing a uh, solid so far as they've been playing so far this season. You know, what do you think you're going to be able to have to pinpoint an attack to overcome them next week? Well, you know, we got to make some plays. You know, offensively, it's, it seems like lately we've been moving the football. It's just getting the ball in the end zone has been a tough thing. You know, we moved the ball today on, on Madison's defense. You know, we, you know, we got, you know, ended the half on a three-yard line, I think, going in. Earlier in the game, we were moving the ball. We, we turned it over one time in the middle of a drive. And, you know, we had a couple of drives. So we're moving the football. It's just that when you get down in that red zone area, you get down to that 40, 30-yard line, now you got to make some plays. Now it gets tough, and, you know, we gotta, you got to make a big play at that time, and that's just what we've, uh, you know, stubbing our toe on right now.